I think today they're projecting at least 50% turnout, which would be, oh my God, fantastic. So, because usually we get 10%, maybe 15 if we're lucky, on an average year. This democracy is a participation sport. Um, everybody come on out um, to vote. Um, it's, we're only as good as all of our opinion, opinions collected, and this is collective opinion. Um, I just wanted to make sure that my voice was heard and that her voice, even though she can't vote, was heard. And I came in to, yeah, to share my vote, to make sure I voted for the right person that I think should be in office. But we finally came to the point where uh, it wasn't going to work just to sit back and complain the way the state was going, that if we were going to do something about it, that uh, it was time to put our hat in the ring. And so collectively as a family, we decided to do that. It's been a big challenge, uh, a lot involved in uh, getting support and getting out, trying to meet all the constituents in her district. Uh, it allows us to decide our future. Like This is the only chance we get, we get really to, uh, to a point the most powerful people in the world. Mostly to not support Donald Trump. I mean, I'm not crazy about Kamala Harris, but I did vote for her just because Trump is would be a disaster in my view. I'm really hoping for, for good things for this country and, and uh, for young people especially. I think it's really hard. So I had uh, grandparents that um, grew up during the Depression and World War II, and I say to my children, um, I'm hoping that some of the angst that you're feeling now could be in some way similar to what people of that generation were experiencing, and it's scary and it's hard work, but um, they hung in there, and the, the later part of their lives, uh, their lives was um, more peaceful and positive. I feel particularly passionate about changing the lay of the land for the legislators in Montpelier, we can't take any more property taxes mm -hmm. and it's absolutely absurd to say that we're going to shut down fossil fuels in the state. It's ridiculous. No other country in the world is doing it. So there's my passion and uh, of course I really care about the national election. I come to make my vote known mm -hmm. and to vote for Harris and Waltz. I think it's a very important mm -hmm watched on TV the debates and uh, that helped make my choice. Is there anything else you'd like to add? Thank you for being here. Thank you for, thank you for, for chatting with us. And, and being a part of the process is, is just a fantastic um, way to build up your civic engagement and to also feel really good about how the whole process is managed. Yeah, I think it's an important responsibility to take take ownership of the society that we live in and uh, cast your vote for the folks who best reflect your views.